Hello everyone and welcome to this Gate.io tutorial. In this video I will show you how to deposit money into your Gate.io account. So in contrast to Binance and most other exchanges you can't deposit via directly into Gate.io. That's why you need to have at least one wallet that's not located on Gate.io. I myself do have a Binance account which I will be using in this video. But what I'm about to show you will also work if you have an account at Coinbase or basically any other exchange. So, what you need to do is to go over to the other exchange, for me that will be Binance. Now you need to look for a button called Withdrawal. In most cases, this button is located below the Wallet section. If you are using Binance, you need to go over to Wallet and then click Fight and Spot. As you can see, right here we can do Withdrawals and Deposits. So, once you have clicked on Fight and Spot, you will be sent over to a page looking like this. In the top right, you can see the Withdrawal button. So, click on Withdrawal. You will now be sent over to a page looking similar to this one. The first thing you need to do is to select a coin you want to transfer to Gate.io. You can select a coin by clicking right here. Then this coin selector will pop up. Right here you can scroll through your holdings, or you could search for a specific coin by using the search bar. So, now that you've selected the coin you want to transfer, the next thing Binance asks you to do is to fill in the address you want to send your coins to. If you don't know how to find your address at Gate.io, I will show you how to find it right now. So, go over to Gate.io, and then go over to Wallet and click on the button called Deposit. On this page, you need to select the coin you want to deposit. So, if you're transferring Ethereum, you need to go over to this search bar and search Ethereum. If you're about to transfer a coin like Bitcoin or Ethereum, I would recommend to trade your holdings into Algo, since by doing so, you will pay a way less transaction fee. But since I'm transferring Algo, I will go over to Algo and click on copy. Always double check if the address you have selected belongs to the right coin, because if you send a coin to the wrong address you will lose all the funds you're transferring. For example, if you're transferring Bitcoin, but you accidentally sent it to your Ethereum address, you will lose all the Bitcoin you were transferring. If you double check your address, go back to Binance or whichever exchange you're using. Now you need to copy paste your address in here. If you're using Algo, the network will instantly be selected. If you're not using Algo and you don't know which network supports your coin, you could do a quick Google search. The last thing you need to do is to fill in the amount you want to withdraw. Once you've filled in all the information, click on withdraw. There will be a pop-up looking similar to this one. Read through all the information to make sure you haven't made any mistakes. Once you double checked all the information, click on continue. Now all you need to do is to go through the security verification process. I filled in everything I need to fill in, and now you need to click on submit. How long it takes for your coin to be transferred depends on which coin you transferred. So once your coin arrived on gate.io, the last thing you need to do is to go over to markets. Here you can trade your coin into USDT. And once you've traded your coin into USDT, you can buy whichever coin you want to. Thank you for watching, I hope this video was helpful. If so, let me know by leaving a comment or subscribing to my channel for more crypto tutorials. See you next time!